Okay, so where is the area? Factory floor this way. Right in the elevator. Here we go. So we're back to the damn dungeon we were at yesterday. I'm going back for a side quest quick. We gotta get to the new area. Let's go to work. Yeah, we leveled up during the boss fight and stuff. Now these enemies aren't as tough anymore. Now I can, like, run through them, see? Yeah, I'm running through them pretty easily. Okay. A Crimson Halberd. Maybe my gaming asks, do I care about viewership? Not really. I really don't care about how many people are here to hang out with me at night when I play, especially when I'm playing a more chill stream like Nino Kuni. I mean, you're not gonna get a mainstream crowd coming in to watch a JRPG like this, especially now that I've been playing it for like two weeks. You know, any of the initial, oh, the big hype because it's a brand new RPG has kind of died out. What I care about is number one, if I'm having fun, which I am, I really like the game. That's number one. And number two, oh, by the way, I'm going the wrong way, I think. Hmm. Yeah. Number two would be, you know, are people supporting? Are people coming out and, you know, being supportive of the stream? And you know what I mean when I say that. You know, things like, like, uh, subbing to the channel and tipping and stuff. And I'll say, honestly, Nido Crew's been okay. It started out much better. Now that we're getting, like I said, further into the game, it's slowing down a little bit. Um, that's why I'm making this more of my late night stream where I can relax and talk to you guys rather than it can't be a featured stream, that's for sure. Um, but it is what it is, you know? I knew, I knew getting into a, a, a long, a long gated JRPG was going to happen, pretty much. I didn't expect anything differently. Where is the other switch I need to push down here? It's there. How the hell do I get over there? Oh. Okay, hold on. Here we go. But I can't jump up there. I don't know how to get that chest. I have no idea. Alright, so in general, Baby Man Gaming, no, I really don't care about the viewership. I don't need to have sky high views on everything that I do. Um. But, you know, it's nice when people are supportive and come out and contribute with it. Like I said, like tipping and subbing, those things are very much appreciated because those are the things that keep it going. Without that, I wouldn't be able to stream at all, quite frankly. You know? Shout out to Soothsayer James for the 100 bit cheer. He says, I've been coming out to watch you since your Alan Wake playthrough. Doesn't really have anything to do with anything, but time really flies. Hell yeah! Especially if you're a fan of me since Alan Wake times. Time does fly, doesn't it? I just put a defensive boost up. Oh my god, did you see that garbage? Dude, he shot a projectile for full screen. I couldn't move out of the way. That was fucking stupid. You gotta be joking me. Okay, 
Alright, where am I going? Fine, this is the very end of this room. I gotta get all the way to the end of the room. Which means I gotta rotate the blue. So I gotta rotate the red, then go back, then rotate the blue, then go all the way back. Watch your back! <laughs> Here, push the button, right? No, I gotta press the button here to go to do the other one. No, that doesn't work. How do I get to the blue switch? Super confusing room from yesterday. It confused me yesterday too. Now I gotta remember this shit. Damn it. Oh god. Here it is. This is how you do it. Yup. Come on. Here it goes. Nice. Double heal. Very good. Suicide so Sayer Jade shoot again. He says, do you ever miss playing competitively? Do you think you would ever do it again? Um, honestly, do I love the feeling of a competitive match with, say, Street Fighter? Yes, I do. You know, that was something that I did for quite a while. I had a lot of fun doing it. Um, you know, traveling, hanging out with people who I would never normally have a chance to hang out with, learning different strategies, and playing competitively. The feeling you get when you get the rush when you're in a competitive match to do the right thing and you win, right? But... The problem is the trade-off. It's very time-consuming. It's very expensive to do it. And quite frankly, you know, I'm not really in a position where I think I could even do it. If I were just to try to do that, this would probably go pretty badly for me. Yeah, real talk, you know. Because I wouldn't be able to, to do, you know, YouTube and Twitch the way that I do it now. I would have to spend so much time sinking into these games to try to play them competitively, like Street Fighter or whatever. It would, it would suffer. Things would suffer. I wouldn't have enough time, you know, to do... Or, oh, well, Phil could just practice all his... You know, stream all his practice for Street Fighter V. But no one's gonna want to watch Street Fighter V constantly. I'm a variety streamer, you know? I made a name for myself as a variety streamer. And, you know, that's where I get my... My notoriety from. People tune in to see me play a variety of games, not just Street Fighter. So... By the way, the reason I'm coming over here is because I never came over here. Look at this. Oh, yes, I did. This was the end of the dungeon. I don't want to do that. I want to go back and just get the item I need for this quest. It's taking forever. Break my legs. Baby Mate Gaming asked, do I miss my office job? Not really. I mean, my office job was an office job. It wasn't like a job that I loved doing and I felt like so much gratitude for or anything. Oh, come on. The door's locked. We gotta find another way. Don't be ridiculous. Give it a bit of a shove. Let's trip the force entry sensor. Flip it up! Well, I guess we gotta kill some robots. I'll do my best. Here it goes. Damn. Well then, that was a beat down and a half. <laughs> yes. That should do it. The door's unlocked. Let's head back to the research lab. So anyway, what I was saying was, 
I wasn't like I loved my office job so much that I was like, oh, I'm so sad that I don't work there anymore. You know what I mean? If anything, there were certain things that felt like they were safer. Like, oh, you know consistently what your income is going to be every month. You know what you're making. And health insurance was way was way better because it was better quality insurance for less. Um, but sadly, the the you know the trade off that I had of the not really liking my job and then no thinking, oh, I have a safe job. It wasn't true. It wasn't safe at all. I got laid off even though I was getting com- commended, commendations at my job and stuff for doing so well. So, really, honestly, no, I don't miss it. Uh, DSP is really cool to you. He said, if you had to wor- worship one of the four chaos gods, which one? Korn, Nurgle, Zinch, or Shlanesh? I would worship Shlanesh, Shlamajal, House of Pepper Incorporated. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. 